Hi, I'm Dr. Yolanda Saber. I'm a research scientist at the Arthritis Research Center of Canada, and I'm assistant professor at the University of British Columbia. Osteoarthritis is the most common form of arthritis, and it's a progressive uh, type of arthritis that leads to pain, swelling, stiffness, and uh, limited mobility in the joint. The knee is uh, one of the most commonly affected joints. Osteoarthritis of the knee is typically diagnosed uh, when it's already at a moderately advanced stage, and that's because it, osteoarthritis is a slowly progressive disease, and patients often wait until they have uh, fairly severe pain before they consult with their healthcare professional. And also, the diagnosis um, is often made based on X-ray, which doesn't tend to find it until it's moderately advanced. In our study, we found that almost half of the population of people with knee pain had degenerative changes on MRI that are, were consistent with a diagnosis of osteoarthritis that would have been missed on x-ray. Although MRI can show knee osteoarthritis at an early stage, it is expensive. In our study, we looked at biomarkers, which are blood and urine tests that can detect the breakdown and buildup of cartilage in the joint. And uh, what we found was that the specific biomarkers are linked to early stage disease, which tells us that potentially we can use them to diagnose early osteoarthritis. Our findings help us diagnose osteoarthritis at an earlier stage, which helps us treat it at an earlier stage. Uh, so with that, we can now help people self-manage the disease through weight loss and physical activity and uh, muscle strengthening exercise programs. And uh, if they have more severe pain, perhaps through the use of pain medications. Treating earlier means we can reduce symptoms at an early stage and potentially reduce the progression of disease.